Hello everyone, this is uh, Antonio again from uh, Random Stuff channel and uh, in this video I wanted to um, just uh, give a, um, some advice to anyone who's not able to transfer files from the device from the phone to the PC. Now off the bat in the past um, whenever I've uh, connected a, an LG device I've uh, plugged in my my USB cable or whatever cable uh, at the bottom of it whether it's type C or whatever and I was able to simply uh, transfer across uh, and using charging or file transfers. Now when I plug in my cable which I'm doing just now um, I only get the option as you can see they're charging and this is connected to a USB 3 fast connection on the, um, on, the on my PC now in order to get the other options uh, made available what we need to do is we need to go into uh, settings and go into developer developer options and there's an option here somewhere uh, I may have passed it, let's so see if I can find it. Select USB configuration, <coughs> excuse me. So here I want to put a uh, media transfer. Um, I thought there was more than that, but if I just go to media transfer and just go back, that didn't work. Try again. Okay, now it is selected, so let me just unplug it. Yes, it's gone, and I put it back in again. Yeah, it still doesn't give me the option, which is really frustrating. Now, I'm not sure if I have to turn them off and then to turn them back on again. doesn't seem to be working I'm gonna I'm gonna re reboot and see if that makes any difference and now we'll start a video again so basically um, on uh, a bad version of, uh, of Windows Windows 10 64 bit maybe a badly installed one I do have reasons why my machine maybe is not working uh, basically I changed the motherboard and uh, had to just renew the, the drivers chipset and uh, graphics uh, drivers but it um, appears that it has not fixed the, uh, the issue and I cannot transfer files between the device and the machine now if I instead put my USB type C cable from my phone connected to the uh, computer uh, to the laptop should I say uh, as you can see here I've got the options which are the traditional ones that we all aware of so just charging or file transfer and I just tested it on my laptop I can easily transfer files backwards and forwards very very fast so a um, couple of things that obviously need to be set up in the in the system by the way if um, the, the screen uh, layout looks different it's because I, um, I attempted to uh, factory reset the device after making a backup uh, thinking that that may have made a difference but it made no difference it was my Windows that was not uh, seeing the USB device and I tried various solutions online or to no avail it looks like I'm gonna have to uh, reinstall Windows uh, not just because of this but because I want to have Windows um, uh, working um, uh, you know perfectly at the moment my fans are overheating and uh, we're well, not overheating they're, they're over spinning and it's just uh, just annoying um, there's lots of stuff out there I'm just gonna restart the machine so uh, rebuild it from scratch but going back to this uh, point sorry for digressing um, the thing is if you go into developer options uh, you'll see here um, I've got USB debugging mode is uh, enabled there in the middle and uh, and the last one that I made sure of was select USB configuration I made sure that I selected that one so after doing that plug it in works perfectly uh, you can use any of these connections via USB okay so 
that's how I solved it. I uh, hope this has helped anyone out there having the same issue on uh, on the V30 or possibly on any other Android device. It's likely to be the Windows uh, being the culprit. Sometimes you can fix it by uh, doing certain things, uh, some changing some settings, and like you can find on many videos on YouTube, but sometimes you cannot fix it and you have to go on another machine. Okay, cheers. Until the next one, take care. Cheers. Bye.